This is Logical Logistics, where we cover shipping, supply chain, logistics, and everything in between. Welcome to the show. Hey, everybody. Welcome to the latest episode of Logical Logistics. I'm Joe Becht. Uh, thanks for all the responses, all the replies, all the listens. Uh, you can reach me at joe at bellair, B-E-L-L-A-I-R dot com. Uh, today, I want to talk about taking control of your supply chain. Uh, here in uh, Chicago, we are doing a bang-up job of uh, supplying PPP, PPE, sorry, all these new acronyms, acronyms uh, coming out are uh, amazing uh, with all the flood of information. Anyway, back to the flood of information as a side note, just listen to Dr. Fauci and maybe one other news source because it's just getting out of hand. Anyway, taking control of your supply chain is key, especially nowadays. And if you really want to take control of your supply chain, you need to work with a quality hands-on white glove service such as Bel Air. You can contact Bel Air at, uh, you can email me, joe at belair.com. Go to BES Logistics. Uh, Logical Logistics, and also Bellair.com, B-E-L-L-A-I-R. So it's really, in this day and age of just desensitized uh, supply chain where you don't know where things are coming from, where they're going, you're in a call queue that uh, can be frustrating, especially nowadays. If you use a company like Bellair, you're going to talk to someone directly involved with your supply chain uh, you can call to make sure if your email e is even received and it's a big ad ad advantage using a company like that uh, to improve the quality of your supply chain so white glove service is really important and essential uh, as far as the global out Look, obviously, we're on a lockdown for another 30 days, but we have, you know, there are essential businesses out there, and Bel Air is one of those essential businesses. And we are out there to help you and to get it out there. And within our organization, we're practicing social distancing. We have uh, small groups that work together. And we're staying as safe as possible. We actually have a licensed public health worker on staff uh, with our operation. If she doesn't get called out with the state emergency, she'll be staying on board and helping us with the, uh, with the uh, process of getting things out. But we're up and running. Um, very valuable information. The, the uh, payroll protection program starts on Friday. If you have not done so, go to your banker immediately and contact to see if and how you can apply for that if you are a smaller business. But if you are a larger business, because we do deal with larger companies, you can still use a white glove service like Bel Air and it's going to really improve your supply chain process, uh, which is essential. There's gonna be a lot of things that are gonna be reevaluated. You know. One of the problems with what is happening with this COVID-19 coronavirus situation is there's so much information. No one knows what's right, what's wrong. It changes constantly. But the, I believe there are some positives that could come out of this as far as sanitation uh, processes. And on the other end, I truly believe that a company like Bel Air is going to be helpful in those processes. So hang in there. Uh, we're going to try to keep you updated as much as possible. I'd like to get some guests. Um, you know, there's people out there we can talk to. Um, there's people out there uh, that are busy. Uh, there's a lot of people with free time in their hands. So we're going to see, uh, you know, who we, who we can talk to. But we're going to keep these daily updates as well. Uh, on the international front, it's, it's very interesting. Um, you know, more and more countries are getting shut down. So it looks like we're getting more regions that are anxious to get things out. Now we're seeing uh, from Southeast Asia, like Vietnam, Cambodia, we're getting inquiries to get things out there. The ocean 
freight is still out there as well. We're getting quite a bit of unusual sales solicitations for masks and hand sanitizer and things like that, which don't really seem on the up and up. But it is very, very strange to go along with these strange times on the communications that we're getting out there. Um, we're in contact with uh, politicians uh, locally and nationally to see you know, what can be done. I think uh, the, the big unknown is a lot of politicians don't know what's going to happen. Um, but I do have a lot of confidence in Dr. Fauci. He, uh, the guy's lineage is there. His uh, record speaks for himself. And I think if there's one guiding light, that should be it. Anyway, good to talk to you. Thanks for the emails. Thanks for listening. And until next time, we will talk soon. Stay safe. Stay healthy. And see you on the other end. Hey, thanks for listening to the show. If you want to drop us a line, email us at becht5 at comcast.net. You can leave comments or if you want to be a guest, becht5 at comcast.net. Also, make sure to review us on iTunes or other media outlets that we're located on. Special thanks goes out to Anthony B., my producer. And we'll see you next time on Logical Logistics. Click the subscribe button for new videos every week and download us and review us on iTunes. Visit www.beslogistics.net for more logistics, transportation, and warehousing resources. Thanks for watching.